Pilot Cooper, Anderson is dead, but we can complete his mission if we can re-establish contact with the fleet. The interstellar beacon ahead will serve our needs. Let's hope someone on our side is listening out there. There is only one way to find out. We must uphold the mission. We should get moving, pilot. Pilot, I see the beacon up ahead. Scans detect minimal power functionality. It may need repairs. Caution, I'm picking up multiple contacts. Hostiles confirmed. The stalkers appear to be programmed to attack the control room. I detect traces of poisonous chemicals within the fog. What is this fog? Scanning. The ground fog is a toxic byproduct of the beacon power grid. I recommend you embark when operating in hazardous environments with greater than one ppm tungsten hexafluoride. Embark and we will move out, pilot. Transferring controls to pilot. I'm detecting militia forces inside that beacon control room. They are signaling distress. Hatching in. Hey! You out there! Pilot! Are you reading us? We can use some help over here! This is Captain Cole for the 3rd Militia Grenadiers. We're getting overrun by stalkers. Please assist! I recommend we help eliminate these stalkers, and then make direct contact with the militia riflemen. Something like this to jumpstart the system, but this one's destroyed. Designation, arc tool. Function, generates power up to five megajoules. Yeah, yeah, we know what it is. Can you repair it? Nah, we already tried. Sensors indicate another one in the substation, but it's nearly impossible to get down there. This place just ain't built for humans. Understood. Pilot Cooper, I advise caution while navigating this facility's substation. You must recover the arc tool. Good luck, sir. Hope you make it back. We've lost too many down there. Taking out Demeter was a huge victory for us. Why doesn't it feel that way? Well, the Demeter fleet was only about a third of the IMC presence on the frontier. Still, 
Every little victory counts. You have the fullest half glass I've ever seen. Blisk and his mercs are cold-blooded killers. It's a good thing someone's been picking them off one by one. That pilot's got to know some interesting tactics. He made it this far. Good luck, pilot. They didn't build this place expecting humans to hit the button. Marvin Delta 73 Zulu, please report to Sector Bravo 7. We're getting low on ammo and soldiers. It's great to have a pilot with us again. Looks like we'll have a chance of getting out afterwards. It looks like they can turtle up to protect their heads. That's why they're so hard to kill. We're doing our best down here. Careful, man. These stalkers can come out of the walls. Stay alert. Pilot more stalker. The last pilot in our unit went that way a few hours ago, but he never came back. Be careful. Pilot, I have patched into your helmet display to monitor your progress. The channel is open if you need assistance. VT, what's up with these walls? Scanning. Exposed power circuits. You should avoid physical contact. Proceed forward with caution. Got it. BT, remind me what I'm doing here. Your mission is to obtain an arc tool. Using it, we can jumpstart the power systems and get the beacon back online. Scans detected signature further within this facility substation.
maze down here. How deep does this thing go? Scans reveal a maximum depth of 300 meters. What is this place? The station's computer details this location as the power grid for an IMC interstellar beacon. Silo. The fan exhaust is non-lethal. 